Hey, Dr. John here in Arkansas. Just had a great conference here in Arkansas. I met a lot of wonderful foster parents, a lot of social workers, and I've been doing it for, I've been the road for quite some time now. And every time I come home from the road, I know, I know that when I walk in the door, I'm on duty. My wife takes care of the kids when I'm away. You know, sometimes we have six, seven, eight, nine, up to 11 kids in our house. And sometimes I walk in and my wife says, tag, you're on. And that's fine. That's okay. Because sometimes she's had exhausting time. You know, she's been under the, under the pressure and she's had exhausting time. I couldn't do it without her. That's for sure. But I wouldn't expect her to do it all by herself. It's a team effort. You know, as a foster parent, you know that what you do is, is so important that you need your spouse to help you. Because it can be exhausting. There have been those times when I have had to step away myself sometimes. You know, when I come home from a long day at work or I have been with the children all the time. My wife has been away at work and we've had all the noise in the house. You know, you've got the screaming baby. You're changing diapers all day long. You have those kids coming to your home and they've had no structure. They've had no uh, type of discipline. There's no consistency in their homes. And they come into your house and you're trying to provide that and they can't accept your structure. And they are just you know, full on crazy, full on loud, and you just need to say, I need to have a moment alone. It's okay to just step outside for a moment and take that deep breath and just say, otherwise, if you don't, if you don't take that moment that you need, here and there and tag off to your spouse if you're so lucky to have one like myself if you don't do those things you're going to get burned out you are going to get exhausted you're going to wear down and you're just not going to be good for anybody so recognize those times when your own frustration is building and your own exhaustion is building and your own weariness is building and you need to tag off to somebody else and just take that cup of coffee and just take that, that stroll around the park or just take that time and just say, <sighs> because if you don't, you're not going to be good for anybody now, are you? Hey, I know what you do is exhausting. I know what you do can be wearing and draining. But know this, what you do makes all the difference. You really are. Without a shadow of a doubt, you really are changing our planet one child at a time. For Foster Care 101, I'm Dr. John DeGarmo.